in a manual car, you don't need to change up and down the gears one at a time. You can actually skip gears, but why would you want to do this? So here, I'm gonna start slowing down. I'm in fifth gear and I'm going down one gear at a time. As you can see, having to do all this leg and arm work to slow down the gears at the same time as slowing down is prohibiting how quickly I can slow down. So this time I'm starting in fifth gear again and I'm gonna slow down without changing gears. And as you can see, I've managed to slow down a lot more quickly and I didn't have to change down any gears. I'm in gear five still, pop it into gear one straight away and I can get going again. I saved myself three gear changes there. This time I'm gonna do the emergency stop and I certainly don't wanna be messing about with the gears when I'm doing that. So gonna do it now. There we go, stop very, very quickly. No gear changes needed. Okay, well, skipping gears when you're changing down may be more obvious, but why would you skip them when you're going up? Okay, now I'm gonna try and accelerate as quickly as I can up to 40 miles an hour, going up each gear one at a time. Let's see how long that takes. No one's coming, let's get going. Changing gear, about 2,000 RPM like I'd normally change. 21, changing gear 30, having to change gear again, 40, I'm in fifth gear now at 40 miles an hour. That took some time because every time I changed gear, I had to stop accelerating. So that really added to the time it took for me to get to 40 miles an hour. I apologize for the bumpy road. This time I'm gonna accelerate up to 40 miles an hour, but I'm not gonna use gear three. I'm not even gonna use gear four, I'm just gonna use gear one and two, and then when I'm at 40 miles an hour, I'll skip straight to gear five. Let's see how long this takes. So, let's go. Into gear two, about 20 miles an hour, and I'm at 40, and into gear five. You see, not having to keep changing gear really helped me speed up more quickly. Skipping gears three and four allow me to continue accelerating without having to push the clutch down to continuously change gear. So basically, the reason why you will skip gears is simply to try to accelerate more quickly or brake more quickly. That's all for this one. Please subscribe if you wanna get my future videos and leave any comments as to what videos you wanna see in the future.